The case was dismissed upon receiving a dismissal letter from the alleged former officers of RTA who filed the allegations against CEO Terama. A relieved Terama shared. Here yeah, I'm informed the general public that the case has been uh, dismissed and now I'm uh, going back to my normal duties as the CEO of RTA and I will continue to serve the organization as required by law. So uh, we, it has really affected uh, the uh, operations of the organization a uh, bit time. So uh, we will uh, uh, start, you know, going back to normal uh, operations. This was his appeal to the general public and responsible statutory bodies. It is an allegation, but uh, it is proper to get both sides of the stories uh, before we, you know, go ahead and do take action on it or report the matter. So uh, I think it applies to not only to me, but uh, others as well. So for a good, you know, to uh, maintain the integrity and uh, a reputation of an organization and uh, for an individual, I think uh, it's proper for fair, you know, reporting and at the same time uh, going ahead and then, you know, going ahead with uh, taking extra action from me on this. So, I mean, this is my appeal to the general public because I served this organization for the last 24 years and uh, I built my career uh, to this far. Mr. Terma also made an appeal to the media to report responsibly as reports can be tarnishing to one's reputation. Amanda Ilaitia, National MTV News.